Hi everybody, thanks for tuning in to the video on this 2017 Chevrolet Cruze. This particular Cruze is the LS trim level. It's one of the more affordable trim levels from Chevrolet, but it still has a lot of the uh, basic features that you come to expect in a modern day vehicle. Power locks, windows, mirrors, uh, backup camera, and Bluetooth that I'll show you when we get inside. Starting off up front here is the uh, typical Cruze styling. It was uh, redesigned uh, around 2015 or so. They refreshed the front end. Uh, I think the 16 started the new body. Um, still has that, has that front end on it. Do have a uh, steel rim covered up with a uh, silver hubcap. These are mounted up with a Continental Pro Contact tire. Uh, that tire is about uh, probably 7, 30 seconds or so of tread. Uh, so a little better than 70% of its original depth still on the tire there. In the back, we do have another Continental Pro Contact tire matching. All of your Chevrolet and Cruze badging back here. If you look up under this section, you'll be able to see uh, the backup camera location. It's right there. Sitting up the side, we'll take a look on the inside of the vehicle here. Like I said, you do have all your power windows, locks, and mirrors located in a standard fashion here on the door. Uh, light controls are down here. Obviously, there is an automatic function for the light control. The driver's seat is a six-way manually adjustable seat. So this actually raises and lowers the seat base. If you pull up on it, it'll bring it up. If you push down on it, it pushes it down. This adjusts the back, forward and backwards, and then that up there slides you forward and back. Just jump in real quick. Vehicle is being sold with two keys. All the vehicles we sell here do come with two keys. It's about a $200 value on this car to buy the key and have it programmed. Fired up uh, pretty uh, low to average miles for a uh, 17. People generally put between 12 and 15,000 on a year. Uh, this is about a two year old car at this point, so you'd expect to see anywhere from 24 to 30,000. Uh, so a little below that at 19,800 good miles on the car. See all of your turn signal stuff over here, wiper controls here. Uh, down here, you got ample space for, you uh, got some cup holders, a little bit of storage space here, and a little bit of closed in storage space inside that center console. Uh, looking here in terms of uh, plugs, you do have both a USB and an auxiliary plug as well as a 12 volt power supply uh, to plug in whatever chargers or your phone uh, if you'd like to bring uh, your audio into the car via the U uh, USB or the auxiliary port you can do so. You can also Bluetooth audio in through the car. Uh, taking a look here you have AM FM radio, again you can use your USB or the auxiliary, auxiliary or you can bring your audio in uh, with the Bluetooth the same way you do with your phone calls. Looking down a little further, all standard climate controls here. The backup cameras in these are actually really nice. They're a, a pretty nice, crisp, clear camera. And this line actually moves when you move the steering wheel. It'll show you exactly where the car's headed. Uh, so if you're headed into a garage door or a parking space, you can just align that where you want it. And the back end of the car will wind up exactly where it says it's going to go. Turn the car off here. Taking a look in the glove box, another uh, difference here at All Things Automotive. We like to show you the results of our mechanical inspection in the glove box of every car that we have. So taking a look at this particular cruise, uh, we did an oil change, uh, filter, did rotate all the tires. They are all 730 seconds of tread, so that's about 70% of the original depth of those Continental tires. Uh, and then did a brake service, so cleaned out uh, the calipers, lubed up the slides and everything, put everything back together, made sure there's no dust or uh, issues or any kind of uh, lips or anything on the uh, rotors. Taking a look real quick at the auto check. It is, uh, quote unquote, a clean auto check. No accidents, no airbag deployments. Uh, this is actually just a lean record. We'll show you that here. Maybe. There we go. So the original lean card did have a lean on it at one point. Obviously that lean's been satisfied and we now have a clear title, um, but the lean still shows up as a record. And then service and repair is just that a dealership that serviced this car at one point in time did report the repair to auto check or the service to auto check, uh, which could be, let's just look back here in the history segment. Yep, you can see that it, uh, Frederick Chevrolet Cadillac at one point performed a multi-point inspection on the vehicle. Uh, so that's all that means. So nice, uh, boring auto check there. Nothing exciting, just the way you like to see them. And it is a one owner vehicle. I did forget to point that out. Stepping out of the vehicle here. Last part of the vehicle, to, or last part of the video, just gonna walk around, try to show you any dents, dings, or imperfections that I do see. Um, I would like to point out there is one dent on the vehicle in the back. Uh, our dent, uh, dent repair specialist does come once a week, so that'll actually get pulled out later on this week. 
Um, so no worries there. Starting off up here in the front, do have a couple minor imperfections in the paint. See those right there. Actually, that just came off. That's nothing. Continue around the side, everything looks pretty good. I don't really see any dense dings. Uh, the hubs are all, hubcaps are all good. That little dent I was talking about is right here. Uh, that'll get pulled out later this week. Shouldn't really be able to see it anymore after that. Everything looks good. It's actually a super, super clean car. Uh, all the rims and uh, tires look good, not cut up, no dense dings, no big scratches or anything like that. So great uh, fuel efficient car. It's actually the uh, car that I drive personally. I believe it's rated for 42 miles of the gallon highway. Uh, if you are easy on them, I often get 45 to 46. Uh, they're just a great little vehicle. If you'd like to come out and take it for a test drive, you can stop out and see us at 21518 Great Cove Road in McConnellsburg, Pennsylvania. Visit us online at thomasata.com or give us a call at 717-485-4224. Thank you very much for watching the video and I hope you found it to be informative.